Number four, the life cycle of HIV, a retrovirus, is distinct from that of most other animal viruses because it involves A, lysis of the host cell to release new viral particles, B, synthesis of DNA from an RNA template, C, the use of host cell machinery to replicate the viral genome, or D, the self-assembly of new viral particles in the host cytoplasm. Now you may remember that most organisms that are infected by viruses that are not retroviruses may undergo lysis of their own host cells. Their cellular machinery may be hijacked by the virus and the virus may undergo self-directed self-assembly of the new virions in the cytoplasm of the host cell. This knocks out A, C, and D, leaving B, the synthesis of DNA from an RNA template. And of course, this is the signature of a retrovirus. Retroviruses specifically employ reverse transcriptase to turn the fundamental dogma of biology on its head and to go backwards from RNA to DNA in order to insert themselves into the host genome.